Well, Halloween now just a few days away, and the city of Anoka is saying go big or go home. <laughs> the largest pumpkin in North America will be carved into the world's largest jack o' lantern tomorrow. Rose Schmidt with us now, and the pumpkin is Minnesota grown, of course, and on display in Anoka. It's had a cross country trip, and still more stories to tell. And Kelsey, this is definitely a first for me. Before today, I have never been able to say that I've stood next to North America's largest pumpkin. This pumpkin took 180 days to grow and it's making quite a name for itself and also giving Anoka pumpkin to talk about. In a city that prides itself on celebrating orange and black. Anoka is obviously the Halloween capital of the world. I thought it was fake at first seeing it. Anoka has yet another Halloween accolade to be proud of. And he was just showing me on the internet, we were looking like, oh my God, Anoka has the world's largest pumpkin this year. Displayed right in front of City Hall for all to admire. It's like literally the great pumpkin. You might say it's squash goals, a pumpkin that has been across the country and back. So this is Maverick, uh, 2,560 pounds, North America's largest, largest ever grown outside. Travis Ginger was crowned the pumpkin king earlier this month when this horticulture teacher set the new record for the country's heaviest pumpkin, a contest he also won back in 2020 with this one. In Minnesota, you know, the weather goes from 40 degrees to 90 degrees, so it's always a crapshoot, but uh, to do it uh, this year was pretty special. Love it, love it. But he'll tell you Maverick, a nod to Top Gun, is the real story. The pumpkin he says no one thought would make it when it started out as a seed in April. And the reason why we named it Maverick on day five, I dropped that five gallon bucket on it and that's where all the scars came from. And it just came back better than ever. It's set to be carved into an eagle as a symbol of our nation in the city where it means so much. So now we're gonna have the biggest pumpkin and then we're gonna have a Guinness World Record carved pumpkin from Anoka. And the plan is to carve this pumpkin right here tomorrow. It's expected to take 10 to 12 hours, so quite a long time. And this pumpkin is expected to break not one, but two world records for the largest jack-o'-lantern by weight and by size. And we will be streaming that carving on Fox 9's YouTube channel. Now, Randy and Kelsey, before I send it back to you, I just had to show you that I dress for this occasion. So we're doing a pumpkin story. I have my pumpkin earrings on. Oh, I that. have my orange turtleneck, my black pants. We're all ready for Halloween. We almost can't yes. see you. You blend right in. <laughs> <laughs> Way to just really get into the story, Rose. All right. We are so excited that we get to stream this. Yes. So stay with Box 9 for all pumpkin news. Yes, it'll be, a, it'll be fun for the, uh, for the kids to watch too, right? Yes. And those pumpkin seeds. Um, I want to see how many of those come out of there too. The grower oh uh, raised a good point. We had such a weird sort of growing season this year that it was a challenge mm -hmm. to get it to where it is now. Right, definitely. I don't know much about growing pumpkins, to be honest. Oh, there's but a lot involved in I, that. I don't I doubt it. I yeah. mean, that thing is huge. It's massive. Well, Maverick? A, is that the a, name? It's a record. It is a record. Wow. Maverick, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. My, my pumpkin at home is just just a little guy. Normal. Yeah. Baby I'm good at buying pumpkins. In yeah. Fact, I buy too many every year because every time I go to the store, I feel like I need mm -hmm. another one. Oh, yeah. I mean, how can you not walk into Target and you grab all the pumpkins? Because you don't want to be that person that after <laughs> Halloween, you see pumpkins still sitting there that never got purchased. Right. I actually thought about that today. <laughs> I saw pumpkin patches, <laughs> these abandoned pumpkins. Oh, no. Those no. will get tossed and thrown into the no. street by teenagers. Kelsey, we need to make a... a, a <laughs> we need to save them. <laughs> we need to go save them tonight. <laughs> we will go to all the Lunds and Byerleys and buy all the pumpkins because, yeah, we don't want them to be alone.